Good morning to you. Uh, the whole purpose of having this legislation is to give official status to British Sign Language, to give recognition to British Sign Language as a language that's used in the UK. Currently, it doesn't have any legal protection or legal status just now. And when we think of other languages that are used across our devolved nations, Welsh, for example, there is legislation in place to protect the language rights of those individuals. But that is not true of the deaf community. That is not true of British Sign Language. So the purpose of this legislation is to ensure that the language of the deaf community, British Sign Language, has legislative protection, which hopefully thereby encourages more access and more inclusion for deaf people in society. And uh, Matthew, you've just obviously interpreted that by watching this all on the screen and simultaneously now doing sign language in order for David to understand what we're saying. Um, but this would have implications for you as well, Matthew, because it would mean that there are more of you, presumably, making uh, interpreters more readily available for perhaps youngsters coming up through the system. Um, I, I'll jump in instead of instead of Matthew to, yes. to enable Matthew to carry on working as an interpreter. Uh, but roughly right now, we have about 1,300 sign language interpreters on the register of sign language interpreters who are qualified and registered to provide sign language interpreting services. But 1,300 interpreters across the whole of the UK is, is not very much. So this is hoped, I guess, as, as you've alluded to, that if we had legislation uh, we, we might well see the trickle-down effects of that, seeing more children learning sign language in school, um, maybe seeing more people wanting to train and qualify as an interpreter. But also, let's not forget, if people are learning sign language, we don't need to have interpreters potentially because deaf people might be able to access services directly. So I, I think there are a lot of trickle-down services that, that would be you know, benefited from this, including hopefully an increase in sign language.